Alright, good afternoon everybody. Um, as you can see here, I'm starting to work on my panel. Um, I just gave it a first coat of paint, and I'm just letting it kind of sit and dry for a little bit. And I have the, the cap over here, the doorknob over here. Um, I need to spray that again because it still needs a bit of paint. So I'm gonna wait for a few minutes and I'm gonna give this a second coat and that a second coat and they're the two paint cans I'm using. So I'll uh I'll wait for a little bit and I'll see what I can do. Okay, um right there as you can see there's the panel, and there's the doorknob. Um, I did move because in the previous spot, I forgot that there were um, yellow jackets hanging out near the house, and uh, I did not want to get stunned. Um, and uh, they weren't bothering me before, but now they're bothering me, so I moved out back from out front, and that's where I'm going from now. Um, so yeah, the bees have been really bothering me so far this year. Um, I just cannot get away from the bees. So, wherever I go, they seem to find me. Um, especially these yellow jackets. So I gave the panel another uh, coat of paint, and I gave the doorknob another coat of paint. So, I'm probably going to do one more coat of paint. And on top of that, I have to do the interior of the panel. Um, and once that dries up, then we should be good to go for installation. Check it out. I look like Jason Voorhees. <laughs> so I waited for about a half hour, and what I did was I opened up the panel. And I thought it'd be kind of cool to spray the interior of it. Um, I just got done spraying it, so it's still pretty wet yet. And I'm looking through my phone for my shade, so I really can't see what I'm filming. But yeah, this is what the interior of the panel is going to be like. Um, I just need to flip it over and just spray paint the back of it. But otherwise, this thing is actually coming out much better than I intended. Although, I just noticed that there's some... Um, paint there around the, yeah it won't really be noticed because we gotta cut the grass anyway in a few days so update on the doorknob uh really haven't done much to it um i did spray paint it really good and it actually is coming out pretty well so i only gave it two coats of paint and so far it is doing well. Um, I am about one-fourth of the way with this yet. Um, so I don't have that much left spray paint in here. Although I only, I only use just a very tiny bit of this paint. So this is probably has to be at least, uh, around two-eighths, three-eighths left of it. Um, what well, halfway, I really can't tell. But there's still a lot of paint left in there. So, if I want to make a, a sink module back box or whatever, I can always use that just to do something else. So, I'm going to wait again for another 15-20 minutes and see how that turns out. And I'm going to try to finish up the panel for the day. So, one thing I learned about uh, building panels and stuff like that, or spray painting, these warm water when you're washing your hands and have like a wet towel to um, aggressively scrub off the paint because if the paint is still kind of wet yet um, you'll be able to get it off um, let me rephrase that when you're washing your hand after doing spray paint you want to leave this on a warm but not hot setting and you want to make sure this is warm and you want to 
scrubbing your hands with these. And the faster you get done from painting to um, scrubbing your hands, the quicker the paint's going to come off. Um, I learned that the hard way when I was in high school, when I was building my fire truck. And it works pretty well. Um, my hand was completely covered in black paint, and as you can see, it's not covered in black paint as much anymore compared to as this, where you can see like little spots, and that's just to paint any over, paint over any um, missed stuff. So here's a little quick tip on how to clean up after spray painting. So uh, that'll be it for the assembly for today. I shouldn't say assembly, but that'll be it for starting the panel for today. Um, so I moved it over by where the garage is. Um, put the spray can down just to hold the hold the cardboard down a little bit. And I'm gonna let that sit out for the night and dry. And once it's late at night before I go to bed I'll bring this in to see how it is. And um yeah, it'll be set to go to start assembly then. So, I'll see you all in the next one.